and today I'll be speaking on the topic Chemo, the best way to beat cancer. Good afternoon, I'm Dr. Ajay Gupta, Senior Consultant in Medical Oncology at the Indraprasth Apollo Hospitals. Chemo refers to chemotherapy. And what is chemotherapy? Chemotherapy is the introduction of drugs or chemicals into the body which disrupt the DNA dividing process in the rapidly dividing cancer cells and thus make them incapable of dividing any further or cause, or cause further harm and thus they help in preventing or beating the cancer down. So chemotherapy is given in three types of treatments. So first is neoadjuvant chemotherapy. So neoadjuvant chemotherapy refers to the fact that the tumor is very big in size and cannot be successfully operated but is otherwise localized. So chemotherapy helps in downsizing or downstaging the cancer and many a times you get a complete pathological response to chemotherapy in that the whole tumor vanishes away. So that is considered a good prognostic factor in chemotherapy and new adjuvant chemotherapy is now being used in a variety of cancers including lung cancer and breast cancer to improve surgical and radiotherapy outcomes. The other way in which chemotherapy is used is adjuvant chemotherapy. So it has been discovered even after surgery in many cancers like breast and the colon the tumors recur. And when the tumors recur, they can cause a lot of problems. So to kill the small cell load which is still present in the body after surgery, chemotherapy is introduced and this is known as adjuvant chemotherapy. This is given for a few, uh, few cycles, usually six, to cover 18 weeks of treatment in most cases so that the uh, tumors are killed and the patient uh, survival rates from that cancer are improved. So chemotherapy has been very successful. Almost all the solid tumors including lung, breast, stomach, gastrointestinal cancers to improve the prognosis of patients. The third is palliative chemotherapy. In many patients, 70% to be precise, the cancer is already spread to various organs of the body and the cancer can no, no longer be operated or be radiated upon. So in this case, what we do is that the patient uh, is given chemotherapy alone and the tumor cells get killed. Once they get killed, then they stay quiet for variable periods of time and this can give patient a meaningful survival advantage. So these are the three ways in which we use chemotherapy. Chemotherapy is also curative in very highly cell dividing cancers and these include a lot of the pediatric tumors like rhabdomyosarcoma, neuroblastoma, then the childhood leukemias, adult leukemias, lymphomas, germ cell tumors. These are, and germ cell tumors were the first tumors uh, uh, along with Hodgkin's lymphoma in which chemotherapy was very effective in disrupting the, bringing a cure alone with chemotherapy, which was indeed treated as a miracle at that time. So chemotherapy is still one of the best ways to beat cancer though. New treatments are being evolved in combination with chemotherapy, including targeted therapies and immunotherapies about which I'll be speaking in my subsequent videos. Thank you.